blog is actually our 10th one. can't believe we've been doing it for 10 weeks. It seems like two weeks. So this week is kind of cool because I um, spent a little bit more time filming in the office. Uh, I took some time to answer some fan mail and um, had a couple meetings and I talked about life hacks. One of them is about uh, how to disguise not washing your hair. And surprisingly, I look the same in that clip as I do right now, but the difference is my hair is actually clean. Um, I just didn't, I went to bed with wet hair, so like I had like really coarse Mexican hair. So um, I just braided it and put a beanie on, which is actually my life hack for not washing it too. So it's kind of just when your hair doesn't look good, you just braid it and put a beanie on. Anyways, um, also talk about some of my um, endeavors with business and some writing I've been doing for different publications and um, talk about making lists, how it makes me more productive. Uh, I also got my hair dyed this week and what? I got a tattoo. This is the first part of my sleeve. It's really grossly peeling at this point. Um, I've heard it's going to get worse from other people who have tattoos, but this is just the first half. I'm going to finish the sleeve hopefully at the beginning of February and um, I'm super happy with it. It didn't really hurt that bad, which I think, because I started actually wanting to go to sleep during the tattoo, which I think makes me a serial killer, because um, it, it the pain wasn't that bad, it kind of put me to sleep. So the only part that hurts when it's close to the bone or um, if they have to go over what they've already like freshly tattooed, that feels that does not feel good. Um, so I'll finish that soon and show you guys the, the finished product, uh, product when I, uh, as soon as I do that. Good morning. It is super cold in Florida. It's the coldest day of the winter, actually, and today's January 18th. Gross. I'm about to have a meeting with my accountant and my bookkeeper, which is why I'm here so early, and I have to erase some dicks from my whiteboard because that's not professional. So this has got to go. What? So life hack. If your hair is really dirty and you are too lazy to wash it or too tired or you just don't like to wash your hair, like me, uh, just braid it messily, curl some pieces, and then put a beanie on and you're good to go. Just don't let anyone take your beanie off because it is a nest under here. Not here. <laughs> We're at family night and um, with your, with uh, I'm like, less Asian brother. <laughs> <laughs> I almost mouth kissed her, but then I remembered this was for her work, so <laughs> I got my makeup on her shirt uh, instead. But it's clean now. Yeah, you can have all the toffee. Oh, hell yeah. You're going to be chewing it for like five minutes. I'm going to chewing oh, mine yeah. for like five minutes too. There's I regret my decision. Has, like, I no, that is good. That was crunchy. It's chocolate Friday and I have to cover my mouth for this. I still feel like it's in my teeth. I finally got the chance after Christina reminded me 17,000 times to get to the fan mail. Um, so I have uh, people who are wrestling fans. This one's a terrible one. I have playing cards from when I was in WWE. Don't even get that. Get this one. <laughs> uh, I was playing cards from when I was in WWE. And um, so people send these and I autograph them and send them back. The key is send them to my warehouse for celestial bodies and send um, an envelope that has postage on it already. So it's easy for me. So it's pre-addressed with postage and it's easy for me to sign something and send it back. My friend Eb drew that. It says, fuck you peasant and that's Simon. Um, and then these are, I keep a lot of the letters that I get from you guys just like on my little thing behind my desk. And I have, I have my biggie action figure on my desk too. My, my bud, my bestie. Caitlin gets injured. Come on WWE. Look at your face. Wait, it's got to focus. Can you read it? Uh, yeah, you can read it. So this is a storyline. Caitlin gets injured by a mass figure and has to forfeit her title shot. This storyline went on for weeks. I had to literally, because it's pro wrestling and everything's so ridiculous, I had to wear a wrap, an ankle wrap, like tape, you know when you get a tape job on your ankle when you have like a sprained ankle or whatever, you play sports? I had to get a tape job over my wrestling boot so people could see that I was physically injured. <laughs> For like weeks, and I was like, why? <laughs> She's trying to stop it.
Your body. Left Wild Orchid Hair Salon, which is my favorite hair salon. So if you're in South Florida, shout out to Wild Orchid. I just got my color because I have gray hair. I'm old. I am super excited today because I dug, got my hair done, and number two, I'm getting the first part of my sleeve done at um, this really cool shop. Uh, down in um, Fort Lauderdale. I'm going to film a lot of it, so stay tuned. And I'm actually uh, really scared that it's gonna hurt, but fuck it. We're out to face parking. I'm just gonna get a ticket. <laughs> I, <know. laughs> I hope I don't have a ticket already. Put it on my tab. To the urge, but it's fighting. Dies. <laughs> Probably probably dies. It's recording. It's literally white. just on your it's teeth right, right now. That's your true. teeth and yeah. chip. You gotta work out a little hey, bit. Hey, Bebe. Super fun. Like, let's see you try to help someone fall off of a cliff. I think it's perfect. Size wise and spacing. Okay. 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 everything for right now usually I'm like behind by a million things everything I needed to get done today I got done and it's only 3 45 I do this thing which I'm sure a lot of people do because it's very helpful I make a list of my top five things that I have to get done for the day sometimes it's more than five sometimes I don't always get it done but today I'm, I'm done for the stuff that I absolutely had to do today uh, when you own your own business there's the work is never done, but for my like top tasks I had to get done, they're done. So I have some extra time right now um, to get a head start on some articles that I've been writing. Two months ago, maybe it's been three months, two months I think I hired a PR company to start getting my voice out there, my name out there a little bit more, as well as social bodies. So I've had all these really cool opportunities to write for different publications and stuff like Forbes.com and Sway.com and um, some of my stuff has been published, not all of it has yet, but it's been really cool kind of putting myself out there and writing about my um, experience as a business owner and an entrepreneur and all the things that I am, a wrestler, like basically everything and just kind of what I've learned and how I apply it now and, and you know what message can I send to other young entrepreneurs or women entrepreneurs or stuff like that. So it's been pretty cool. So talking about uh, recent things that I've been published in, um, this is Thrive Global, and I oh, up there I am was added to this list of 99 limit breaking female founders to share the most significant lessons learned from their experiences. So there's a lot of really cool chicks in here. Um, this is kind of like a little collage of everyone and there's a little bit about each one of them and what they wrote and what they learned from their experiences there's videos pictures so i'm on this list which is super fucking cool the dog is part wolf mm -hmm. um so he's aggressive with his water bowl but it yeah water bowl mm -hmm. let's say besides that he's like a giant teddy bear doesn't care what you do do you want to meet the wolf 
Yes. What's the wolf's name again? I always forget. Loki. Loki. Such a good uh -huh. name for a wolf. Great, great name. It's <clears throat> perfect for him. It stands for God of Mischief. <laughs> Just great for him. You're the tr you're the god of trash. I am trash Roman. <laughs> Which hate my Instagram and trash Roman. Yes, trash films. Trash films. Official. <laughs> Uh, Stefano just posted your video on Insta. Sick! Am I famous now? Yes. According yeah. to my calculations. According to my Apple Watch, it says stand up because I'm fat. <laughs>
into the training for it and I'm really super excited so I hope you guys can come out if not um, I will get tons of video footage of it and I will also be releasing more Road to the Ring um, sneak peeks on my Instagram and I'll start uploading it to YouTube as well so uh, thanks for watching